Hello, everyone. This is Grandmaster Alexander Landerman, and um, I'm playing. I'm going to be playing a match against a very talented young Indian player, Srinath Asuna. It's hard to pronounce his name, but Naranyan uh, from India. It should be a very challenging match, uh, but we'll see what happens. All right, so let's play some theoretical line. Let's see what he has in mind against this. <clears throat> This should be seven. I'll go g3, transposing into some Catalan. Bishop g2. And we will um, play the game like this before and see. Try to recall. I, I think I should play b3. Because castles d takes c4 is the problem. Ninety-two, ninety-six. Yeah, so he's a very good player. I'm playing. Um, I remember in the last Chess Twenty Four Banter Blitz series, I think you got into the semifinal, only losing narrowly to Lorenzo Ferrucha. So he's. Uh, I've seen. Um, I've watched these matches actually. Um, he's a very versatile player. Very good with the initiative. So will be kind of a difficult match, but um, I consider him to be a slight favorite, but obviously I'll do my best. Um, okay, so this structure I kind of like for white because the bishop on b7 is a bit restricted. All right, so let's see. I guess we'll play rook c1. This position I kind of like to play the structure for white. I usually have the knights on the board, this time knights are exchanged. I'm not sure um, what are the differences, but I guess we'll find out. A5, I'll probably just play A4, stopping any kind of um, A4 ideas from him. C6, okay, let's go rookie one and uh, just get the rook out of there. Out of bishop a6 ideas, for example. So then we'll go rook c2, queen c1, bishop a3, I guess. You can play queen c7. Yeah, so it's just going to be a kind of a cat and mouse game where nothing that much has happened for a while, but I'll just have to play sensible moves and be patient and uh, hopefully be ahead on the clock. So that's sort of my strategy here. In this kind of position, two. And rook c1, and then maybe 91, 93. So just uh, lots of maneuvering. But I like the fact that he's taking a lot of time here. So maybe I can try to exploit that later on. But obviously his position is good. This is salt. Hmm. Let's try 95. Ah, but C5. C5. Okay, so I can uh, can go knight d3 probably. B4. Yeah, c4 looks like nothing. And then we'll play hanging pawn structure. Take it. Hmm. F4. If he takes on a four, then uh, c5 becomes uh, even even weaker because the bishop will not protect it. Otherwise, I'm thinking about ideas like knight h5 or queen g4. Just trying to annoy him a little bit, I guess.
Napa Queen G8. So I can play Queen B5. It's one idea. Queen B5, Queen A8, Bishop takes C4. Yeah, what's happening there? Not sure. Okay, let's try it. Looks a bit annoying. At least he has to. Ah, he played d4. That move I kind of missed. Uh, but can I take on d4 or he goes bishop? Wait. Bishop d4, bishop c6. Huh? Wait. What's happening there? Bishop d4. Bishop d4, bishop c6. Uh, the queen a5. Takes rook c6, rook c6. Ah, I lose there. It's not so good. Uh, queen a5, d3. Hmm. Okay, that's a bit annoying. I need to figure out quickly what. How do I play here? Yeah, okay, I sort of missed that move. That was, yeah, d4 is very unpleasant. Probably should not have allowed that, but okay. Knight d6. Okay, let's take the pawn. Show me what you got. Don't know if that was necessary. Although, of course, the game is still kind of crazy. Queen b5. Yeah, he's gonna give a check. Yeah, he definitely has compensation. Okay, he plays a tricky move to get that king out of there. Queen d3, h5. Uh, can take on d4, I think. H4, bishop e5, h3. H3, just queen d5, I think. Yeah, I don't know what, what he wants here. Am I missing something? Looks like almost winning for me. Okay, I have to be careful. Obviously, takes, takes, those have six ideas. But yeah, I guess we'll go king f1 just to get out of... Um, it will go b4, uh, b5, bishop c3, rook a8. Uh, let's play a5. If it takes, then rook a2. Knight d6. Okay, let's take it. C6. Now the thing is, I need to make sure I don't get tricked by something. Bishop b4, I guess. Okay. Trading one pair of rooks makes my job a bit easier. King e2 now, getting the king out of this. Ooh, rook d4. Still, he's fighting pretty well. Knight d6. Tricky. If I play rook d8, uh, let's just play rook d8. It's the simplest, I think. All right, let's. Ah, okay. Still a bit tricky, huh? King e3. Yeah, we're not going to allow knight f3. Knight c6. Yeah, just a6. <clears throat> and ah, it's still a bit tricky there. There are some tactics. I wanted to play bishop b4, but okay. So pretty nice start for me. I guess I now I'll close this one and uh, open this one. And uh, uh, second. Uh, okay.
So that's the second game <clears throat> about to start. So good start for me. I was able to navigate through the complications pretty well. And uh, at some point he was probably doing well, but it doesn't matter anymore. All right, so let's uh, see what he prepared against uh, my Rubenstein. And let's see if he even prepared against this. Okay, so he plays c3. Let's play c5. Bishop d3, queen c7. Seems like he did prepare. I can survive this, but it's kind of difficult, a little annoying. Yeah, some slight problems, maybe more than slight actually. Just castle, okay. At least we'll kick the bishop away. I was kind of more, more worried about knight c4, but this one I feel like I can maybe survive this. Okay, b5 should be seven. A4. Yeah, that's annoying. Okay, let's take it. Then go bishop b7 and uh, try to survive. Bishop f3. Huh. Rook b8, I guess. Queen takes a4. Hmm. How do we play here? That's a good question. So let's try to at least get my king on g7 to safety. h5 I thought was good because I had two ideas, to hide my king and also threaten hg4 in some cases. At least it's kind of. At least I feel like I'm in the game. I'm not losing right away, but probably I should... Uh, Play the opening a bit different the next time. So knight c6, we will play. Ah, knight c6 is unpleasant. Bishop d7, queen a6, rook b6. Okay, let's let's try that. Ah, he plays just d6 c5. Okay. But okay, let's uh, let's confuse things a little bit. Let us confuse things a little. Okay, knight d5. Or maybe it's just bad. Just, oh, he takes queen d4. Yeah, this is very bad. Oh, I blundered my rook too. Yeah, it's a bad game. Um, okay, good game. Uh, good opening prep. And I didn't handle it very well so back to all square now now we're gonna be white again we're gonna continue playing the same way with white because last time i liked my position with with white so we'll see what happens six c3 Let's see what he played. Ah, uh, should be four this time. Okay. So let's try bishop g5. Let's take it. Uh, 
queen a4. So let's try this line a little bit. Trying to play on a little bit of a squeeze. Trying to play positional here. Okay, so he wants to play five, I guess. Mm. I guess we'll let him play five. Wait, five action, 95. It's, but queen of five takes the odd, and then D. Also, E5, he doesn't really want because 95. Um, Yeah, so how does he play? He's a bit cramped, which is good news. Okay, goes bishop d7, I'll just develop. Okay, let's just play some small moves and see, put the ball back in his court, let him find something to do. Let's look C8. Uh, do I want to play before? He, it just goes A5, you yeah. uh, know. Let's go Bishop A2. The idea of Knight E4, Knight C5, I guess. Maybe this should be one as also an idea in some cases. So queen here. Actually, let's play h4 just to scare him a little bit. Uh, ah, he wants to play f5. Should be one. Hmm. Interesting. Lots of tempting options here. Okay, just go 94. Plays a five anyway. Here I thought I go knight c5. Oh. Looks like he might have to take on the sum. I mean, maybe he can play e5, but then he has to give up material. Oh, bishop h5. Okay, I didn't see that move. I did not see that. Uh, but okay, what what exactly is happening? So if I take, how scary is that? Queen h4, can I take on c6? I think I can. I don't quite see the mate or even perpetual. And I'm threatening to take the bishop next move. 
and then he only has the queen in the attack. So somehow it feels ah bishop g3, but I can still take right. Let's see takes takes king f1 queen h3 king king e2. Yeah, I don't think there's anything here. I mean, it's just one queen. It's just one queen. Yeah, one queen should not scare me that much, I think. Now let's try this. Cover up a little bit. <clears throat> okay, so now we should not blunder something. Still tricky though. Maybe rookie one. I'm two pieces up, but he does have a few threats potentially. Okay. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. He wants to play rook f8. I go queen d7, he goes rook g8. King f2. Should be one. Two. Ah, okay, but queen if oh, there's queen c2, but that's fine. I go queen, queen c2 here, queen c3, queen c4, queen Rook f5. Okay, the guy is fighting well. Now, can I go knight c5? Yeah, I think so. Two extra pieces, but still not that easy in blitz. Yeah, this one, knight c5, looks pretty good, though. Seems hard to deal with. And then knight e6, I think. Rook f5, queen f5. Yeah, that should be game over. Okay, so at least I was able to navigate once again through complications and avoid a blunder. Okay, so we got black again. Oh, it looks like opponent disconnected so i guess we'll wait a little bit to see uh, what happens i know i've seen some older from last season i saw some matches where he got unfortunately affected by disconnections so i'm really hoping that will not be the case this time so i guess we should give him some time to try to see if he can uh, reconnect mm, don't know what what the rules are, but I hope. Okay. Sure. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, okay, sure. Yeah. Ah, okay. no, it still says opponent. Yeah, but I think we should give him time to reconnect because I don't really. Mm. Oh, okay, he played a move. Okay, perfect. Okay, there we go. Excellent. Okay, so let's try this variation this time. And let's see what happens here. Okay. Ah, oh, C4. Mm. Yeah, I didn't know that move. Hmm, interesting. What is this C4? I thought C3 is kind of the main move. Um, mm -hmm. 
If I can play knight c6, I can take on d4. We take on d4 and play cd, ed, and uh, I guess I want to just play bishop d3. Okay, I guess I'll develop. <laughs> Too bad. Bishop d3. Uh, yeah, so I guess he wants some initiative with e6, but okay, don't don't really see it. So I'll just have to. Okay, so just wants to play knight b3. Okay. Uh, let's think. Some good preparation here by my opponent. Okay, so let's play knight e6. Yeah, he prepared very well for my French, as far as I could see. Let's try this. I'm not really sure. It looks like my opponent might be slightly better here, but yeah, this c4 is very un, unusual. I've never seen that in this this particular line. It's very interesting prep. Go g6, f8. Hopefully it's not too bad. Although I don't, not a big fan of my position, truth be told. Um, let's see. It's knight g7 maybe. Bishop g5. Okay, bishop g5, I think I can. Maybe even bishop, mm, bishop f5, queen f5. Mm, nah, don't like it. Okay, just bishop e7. Bishop takes e7. Uh, probably rook takes. So knight d4 takes maybe maybe just knight f5 actually. Yeah, I mean I'm hoping I can survive this. Yeah, let's play knight f5. Yeah, this actually looks not too bad. Although I don't particularly like this, but At five, yeah, so I guess I want to play queen b6. Um, but he wants to play g4. So what I'll do then is I'll play rook back to e8. So after g4, I can go knight h4 and uh, eliminate some of his... Uh... Oh, I forgot he can actually take this. Ah, okay, so he just plays for for a better structure. Yeah, I mean, white is definitely better here, but I feel like it's not so terrible. 
let's just actually it seems like B B4 is also kind of weak. So uh, I'm not even sure if I'm worse here. Okay, so let's take it. And uh, um, I don't know, let's try and go bishop of five also actually. Bring the bishop to e4, but it's very active. But I think I'll just play rook a3. Okay, now I'll go bishop of five because I have rook d3 threat. Rook d1, bishop d3, queen of two. Yeah, I think I'll go rook d3. And uh, okay, it's not quite winning, but uh, so I'll uh, take it. So it should be four, maybe. Rook c1. Take c4. And let's try queen a3. Then we'll go king g7. I ah, equals queen h4 then. But queen king h4, queen c5. Yes, yeah, so it's not that easy for him. Yeah, next move I want to play rook c8. Um, so I'll just go back to e7, cover up my weaknesses, and uh, now I'll go rook c8. Queen g3, but he has a trick. We will not fall for that one. He wanted rook takes e4, now I want to play rook c4. Queen c5 after that. Okay, he plays rook a1. Uh, so we'll go queen c5 in that case. Yeah, he probably plays rook a4 though. Ah, he plays queen up two. Queen up two. Okay, let's try queen b6, taking away entry squares from that rook. Okay, two. Yeah, I still have to be a bit careful here. Uh, he, was, he wants to play rook a2. Okay, so rook b8. And uh, yeah, now I have to just play fast. Very fast. Hopefully avoid a blunder. Play fast and not blunder. That's the goal here. Ooh, I can take. Uh, okay, I'll take again. Queen e5. Rook g7. King h1. Well, queen a1. Yeah. Um, I'm wondering if I could have played for a win here, but don't see how because d4 rook takes d4. I mean, I'm kind of happy to get out of this game with with a draw. Anyway, let's I'll move on to the next game. Uh, try to win my white games and uh, survive the black ones, because it seems like. Is quite well prepared with white, so need to make sure I can survive this. Hopefully, I can win two more games with white. That's the goal. Um, okay, so e6, knight f3 again. Let's keep playing this until he finds something that 
Okay, let's take it. Well, this should G5, I guess. <clears throat> okay, bishop d3. Let's just play the Carlsbad structure. Ninety-four. So I think I'm supposed to just take this, and uh, I think I just played before, kind of ignoring that. As far as I know, on a six, a six. I think I play knight a four here. Knight a six. Okay, so I can play knight c5. What else can I play? So I think I want to eliminate that bishop because uh, it's a little bit paradoxical, but otherwise it's going to attack me. Bishop g4, knight h4. I just don't want to give him any initiative because, especially this, this opponent, because he's, he's very good with initiatives. So. Prefer to play more positional controlled chess with him. Let's see. We might play b5. Not sure how, how good that will be. Yeah, he does. So I'm not exactly sure if I should take it or not, but I guess I will not just yet. Yeah, I think what I need to do here is bring a knight to c5. So let's uh, let's try to do that. Rook b8 and. Uh, Guess we go there. Knight f8. Uh, okay, let's get in that square. All right, so now we need to start playing on the a file, probably. And so if I go to a1, knight c5, d c5, b4. I go rook a1, knight c5, d c5. Yeah, that looks a bit better. Take with the deep one. You can also play knight b6, but then I'm probably pretty happy. Uh, now I can play e4. And the question is, I do it right away? Probably. So Needs to start breaking apart his one structure here, creating a couple of weaknesses. Yeah, then I'll need to make a loft and um, yeah, hopefully hopefully can do something in this position. Rookie eight. Take, take, I guess. Uh, queen d4. 
I'm not sure. Yeah, I'll, I'll need to make a loft because I don't like the fact that back rank problems every position. Yeah, my opponent's taking a lot of time in these quiet positions, which definitely plays in my favor. So queen c6, I guess we'll just... There's no threat, so I can just. Okay, now I can take, 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 take everything and uh, take on c4. Yeah, it doesn't seem that amazing though. Okay, so let's play h4, and uh, in some end game, it could be quite useful. You know, all the pawns are in the light squares now. Okay, so now we'll take, of course, uh, I can play rook a6 now. Rook e1, ooh, <laughs> I missed that move. But okay, it's not that big of a deal, right? I can, if I go king h2, queen c7. Okay, so that's fine, I'll, I'll just take. Okay, now what? By queen f4, take on c4, d c4, rook e7. I can play rook e7 right away. Lots of choices. Yeah, rook e7 right away looks pretty good with my centralized queen. <clears throat> yeah, he plays queen c6. So now I can play queen f4, rook f8. Okay. How do I play in this position? G4 takes H5, looks very good. Does he have a defense against that? Oh, I don't see it. He has 19 seconds. I need to. I need to try. Queen a6. I can play queen d4, but don't really see why not just take, 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 wait. Second so takes, takes, queen h6, queen a1, bishop f1, okay. Should work. Okay, king g2. Ah, uh, king g2 he can play. Takes queen of queen there. Yeah, I think it's winning. I mean, he can take an a, a, a f2, but it's just desperation. Pretty sure. Queen of six, I missed completely. Wow. Completely missed that. All right. Now we have to regain our focus here. Oh. Ay, ay, ay. Oh. Yeah, kind of. Messed it up. Should have won this one. But okay, that's fine. I mean, he probably should have won last game. I should have won this one. Uh, but he defended well. He, I should have just played bishop f1 probably. But okay, it's still in good shape, three to two. Um, so, and looks like my opponents get disconnected. So we'll wait for him to reconnect. Okay, and he's back. So we'll um, we'll try to now survive the black game. Yeah. So. Let's see what he does. Is he thinking or is he disconnected? Not really sure. Okay, play c4. 
Okay, I'll change my opening a little bit. Please D4, okay. D4, and we'll go knight C6. Uh, goes knight E5. Okay, I'll just, you know what I'll do? I'll just play very quiet, just to play a very dull position, just to get him out of theory. Probably it's a little bit worse, but doesn't matter. Just I need to survive the opening with, with black. It's pretty clear because he's quite well prepared for everything. Which is okay. Well, this was definitely not so bad. It looks like um some kind of an exchange French. Not too bad. Hmm. Put the bishop there, huh? I was not sure about that. Uh, but maybe it's good. I did too. And I two is good. How do I play in this position? Should be six, d4, 96, bishop of five. Okay, let's try this. Uh, okay. He wants to play c4. Moves annoying. That move is very good. Nine B six ninety four. Bishop five. Oh, it's a little struggle. Can't really consolidate. Ninety seven, ninety four, ninety six. I think it's I think it's okay, but how oh, you play Queen C2, it wasn't what I expected actually. Yeah, I have very big coordination problems somehow. Yeah, here I'm just fighting for survival, obviously. And then, should she six, I guess? 
trying to at least exchange that that bishop. Then maybe c6, maybe it's not so bad actually. He's playing very fast. Uh, c6 is also a problem. Uh, bishop c8, g6, but okay, that's probably just knight, g, knight g6 goes there. Wow, didn't expect that one. Rook e8. Takes, takes, knight g6. Takes, takes, knight g6. Yeah, the time, I mean, my position isn't as bad anymore, but the time station is not so good. <clears throat> so four Okay. Looks very tough, but you know, my opponent saved a very tough one last time. So maybe I can try to survive this one. He takes, looks like he kind of has to take though. If he doesn't, then knight g5, knight e4. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, I need to concentrate. C8, knight and E5. That setup seems holdable. Yeah. Okay, knight E5. Uh, so E7. Six. I think I got a draw. Wow, it's a tough game. Yeah, so I feel like that kind of evened it out. Um, I probably should have won the last one, but um, he should have won this one. So now I think I'm one win away from winning the, the match. So. so I guess I'll wait till my opponent reconnects and uh, we'll try to focus very hard here so that we don't have to play another black game because the black 
is very tough. Um, So castles should be two, a5. Yeah, a5, I think I can go knight d2. Yeah, bishop a6, I think I play a4. Yeah, he's playing very fast now. I noticed that he can really do that. Uh, so let's see, can I play a4? C5, E, D, C, D, Knight, E2. Yeah, I think E4 is pretty good. D, C4, D, C4. Hmm. So let's see, Knight takes or Pawn takes? That's the question. Knight, knight C4, B5, A, B, C, B. Knight, A5, B4. Knight, E2. I can go Bishop, B4 also. Okay, so I guess I have to take like that. Yeah, e5. Hmm. Seems like not so bad for him. Okay, so maybe knight e2 then, in that case. Now probably next move queen c2, queen c7, queen c2, then knight f3, rook d1, and things like that. It should be four. Okay, I didn't see that move. Very interesting. If I take, what does he want? Knight g4, e6, takes knight f4. Oh, like this even. Wow. Yeah, I didn't see that. This one escaped. All right. So now, all right, how do we play here? I guess rook d1 for starters. This should be four. Um, so now, D1, I guess. Yeah, he's probably fine here. This is probably the best opening he's had with black so far. Rook E8. Okay, I guess I have to take it. Okay, Knight E4. Yeah, and then now I got knight, knight gets to five. His one good piece of the position is the bishop on b4. So probably he's sort of okay, although I'd like to believe maybe I'm a little bit better here. No. Doesn't matter really, just have to play chess. Maybe we play knight of five. Yeah, rook d8. Rook d8, rook d8. OK. 
Okay, so Shvat 3, Kinjitsu is the plan. I was calculating a bit with Shvat 1, but thought he can probably take the pawn. I think I just blundered the pawn. Not good. Okay. Guess we have to fight for survival now. Try to get a draw. Yeah. Okay, so rook d8. You're okay. Yeah, I would. Hmm. Yeah, he played really, really well this game. Yeah, he totally outplayed me out of nowhere this game. Very, very nicely done. Very, very nicely done. What to do? Really good game. Okay. Uh, so, game eight. Um, for all the marbles, I guess. Let's see if I can now uh, follow his trend and and win a black game. Uh, so it will not be easy, but we'll do our best. Not sure what opening I should play. Okay, let's play something solid. So uh, I guess uh, he might be a little bit better because of the uh, weakness on e6. But maybe I should have played knight d5 now that I think about it. Because now he has b3. Well, yeah, I'm not sure. Not sure about that. System. How do I play this? 
Yeah, c4, queen of five is my point. And it takes like this, okay. c7, c4, rook e7, rook e8. Yeah, trying to survive here. Yeah, I kind of, I'm kind of worse, but um, maybe survive. At least he's taking some time. Yeah, at least I don't see how I just get beat right away. My position is quite solid. So maybe I can kind of tread the water a little bit for now. So it's cheap. Yeah, knight g5, king g8. <laughs> it's uh, very easy to blunder in such a position. Queen g3. So if I play king g, I can play e5 also. e5 looks a bit dangerous, but. It looks like it kind of works. Yeah, let's go for it. So next we try to go king g8. If I don't lose right away, at least I feel kind of good about my position. He's calculating, but not so easy. H5, H4. Uh, what's he want with that move? King G8, H5 he wants. Takes, takes. Yeah, that's his idea. If I play H5, then it's hard to go King G8. Hmm, very interesting. I didn't see that. Okay, 5, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9. That doesn't work. I go H6, H5, takes. So H6 is kind of interesting. Uh, now I can maybe even take it. Or no. Or is G5 better? 
probably g5 is better. Because it takes queen f3, I forgot about knight d6 in the end. Uh huh. Rook d2. Wow, rook d2. Where did that move come from? Boy. Twelfth one. Ah. All right. Well, congratulations on uh, winning the match. It was a very close match as expected. Um, I was doing very well for a while, but um, yeah, the last two games were, I think, very good battles. But uh, congratulations to my opponent for coming out on top and good luck to him in future matches. Thank you. Thank you for participating also. And well, it was an excellent match. You were like uh, there ahead at some point, but yeah, it was tough at the end, right? Yeah, the last, yeah, I was ahead by a half point, but yeah, the last two games he played probably his best games. So, um, well, the last game was in the end, I thought I had some chances, certainly. Although I was probably always worse, probably losing earlier, but yeah, this round seven was, I think, a very quality game from him uh, somehow. Uh, like, I thought my position was good, but he played really nicely. So, uh, okay. Cool. Well, 
Thank you anyways, and hope to see you soon on Chess24. Thanks. Thank you.